Okay, I'm gonna tell you how to survive a zombie apocalypse. Okay, guys, it's gonna be a lot of commotion. And there's gonna be a lot of screaming, too. It's gonna help you a lot so you don't be hungry yeah okay so then you need medicine ding ding ha <laughs> these things will help you really well really well and you really need um water too h2o <laughs> yeah h2o okay so you need an ally. You need an ally. Maybe three, maybe four, maybe even a whole group, maybe even a community. Maybe a community. But you're gonna need some stuff. They might even help you. And if they do, you're lucky. Because usually people on Zombie Apocalypse only defend for themselves and their family. FAMILY! So, you're gonna need weapons. You got your guns. You got your bow and arrows. You got your swords. So what else do you need? Bullets. Arrows. That's it. So, get the bullets, go to the store, you know that right? But, there might be people out there that will shoot you for anything, so you're gonna need something else. Protection. Try to build yourself a hideout, try to make a hideout, try to build a tent, try to buy a tent, try to do anything you can. Don't live in the city, go up in the hills, it will help you to look. Always use binoculars, they'll help you too. So when you're up in the hill, you can look around, see what's going on down there, find out where you need to go next. Okay, so, you need to go next. Where do you need to go next? Where do you need to go next? Where do you think you need to go? Find the least possible place where zombies could be. There's no food, there's no water. Where could that be? Um, let me guess. Uh, hmm. Maybe the... Maybe an abandoned city? Because after everything's gone, it's just going to be the zombies left. So they're going to travel. Travel. They're going to travel. And then when they travel, they're going to come up to a different city. That's when you go in and you look for anything you possibly can. So. That's what you do. It's very scary at first. You might not even see your family anymore. But we have to prepare before it happens. That's why we're preparing now. You guys will learn. Okay? So you'll learn. Now, you need. You also need an ally. I already told you you need an ally, but if you want to be a little bit, you know, messed up and all of it, you can kill your ally and get all of his stuff. But, that might be messed up. Only when you need it most. Or he might sacrifice his life for you. Oh. Yeah. So. Or you might just win and everything will be good. Oh! 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 Alright. That's good. That'll be great. That'll be great. But you also need. I think there's one more important thing you need. To survive. Yeah, survive. It's right there. Look at it. It's right there on the wall. You have to. The only way to do that is have walkie-talkies, binoculars, food, water, medicine, weapons, a shelter. And you're good. Radio. To hear where everything's going on. To hear where people are meeting up. To see where the government will put you guys next. 
There's a lot of stuff to do to survive a zombie apocalypse. And I'm Cardo saying, wish me luck, because I think they're coming. I get here. I don't have anything now, but I'm searching. And, 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 you guys gotta wish me luck. To get here. Get everywhere. I'm Cardell Sand. I am out. Peace.